What up dreamers? Welcome back to Dream Star Chaos. I'm your girlfriend Reena and I am excited today because I'm trying to change it up. I'm trying to make it fun and I'm not trying to make it monotonous and I hope you are enjoying this different styles of videos. Today's video like you already know, I will be talking about everything food and I'm so excited for this one. I do have a collection of like a healthy stuff that I'm like binging into but I do also have some really yummy and some really blissful tasteful things for your taste buds and I hope you enjoy because I'm about to share with you the best of both worlds and also don't really expect me to give you like professional actual terms of the food tasting because really the only things I can describe about flavors is is it spicy sweet or sour at the least without any further ado let's jump right into it let's go number one on the list we have is ta-da oh my god this is such a savior I've been having this for about a year or two now and I am obsessed with the Amul dark chocolate now they have quite a lot of different variants in it so if you are someone who likes the taste of um, milky chocolates or you who just likes sweet chocolate but still want like a little bit of a healthy element then you would really enjoy this personally I truly enjoy the Amul 90% or I think 70% dark chocolate which comes in like a darker packaging and oh my god that thing is amazing now that thing does taste like dark chocolate but it's again not extremely bitter it's just got that really in between spot and i really really enjoy it and i recently learned how to make hot chocolate with this and oh my god i'm such a professional just say it let me know if you want me to demonstrate my recipe i will think about it <laughs> Get your hands on this, this is amazing. You get to fulfill your sweet tooth craving without feeling guilty. Definitely much healthier than your regular chocolate. So next up on the list, I have this brand that I came across on Amazon. So first of all, everybody can get your hands on this. And oh my God, this is revolutionary. It's life changing and I'm obsessed with this brand. And I don't really say that about food brands, but this, it's different. And I'm talking to you about Del Monte. First of all, let me tell you my first discovery from them, which I don't have at the moment with me, but it was the Del Monte ketchup. And oh my God, if you have sugar, please don't have it because it's one of those ketchups which was really sweet. But trust me, I hate sweet, but still I just could not stop myself from having it. It just had something in it that kept me going and it was a amazing now obviously we're all used to kisan and like these local ketchups so trying something different felt amazing and you know at first i was like something's different something's different and that's when i realized that oh i accidentally got del monte instead of my regular ketchup but there were no regrets i absolutely absolutely enjoyed it literally everybody in my family loved it and that's rare that's really rare like they don't even love me so for all of us to come together and love an item it's rare <laughs> With that being said, next up on the list is, oh my god, my mom and I, and like again, all of us are obsessed with to be honest, but my mom and me specifically is this, ta-da! This is the um, eggless mayonnaise or mayonnaise, however you want to say it, but trust me, this is so fucking good. Like I am obsessed with this. There were a couple of times in my diet when I got a chance of having some, you know, homemade open bread cheese pizzas kind of something. And oh my God, this stuff came in handy. I'm not sure if I'm supposed to add this. I'm pretty sure I wasn't, but like I did it anyway and there were no regrets. I really, really enjoyed this. This has got that really creamy consistency. It's very fluffy and airy. Those are the terms I believe that I used to describe mayonnaise. I don't know. But this stuff is really really good and again it's eggless so it's like 100% amazing for all the vegetarians all the jains all the vegans everybody out there to try what really pulls up on the number one list which i kept it for last and that is ta-da oh my god my pizzas and my pasta recipes have gone like top notch girl because this pizza pasta sauce is everything like I, I can't even describe the taste of it it is absolutely amazing now for the longest time every time I make I mean I don't really make pastas I usually go at my best friend's place because she makes really amazing pasta but uh, in times of quarantine I had to fulfill my own cravings and I tried doing once a uh, red pasta sauce and it was like a lot of work like I mean honestly all I did was like boiled tomatoes but like still a lot of work and I was not signing up for it and usually I used to use the fun food uh, red pasta sauce and first of all you need a lot of it and second of all it comes in really tiny bottles as far as I've seen them but with this thingy 
where do i begin with first of all i made a pink pasta with this and the mayonnaise and oh my god it was fucking amazing it is extremely flavorful like that's like the word that comes to me it's got a little bit of spiciness it's got a little bit of tanginess now for me i hate tangy but with this it's very mild it's mostly spicy and it's it's just i don't know what is the deal with it i really wish i had more vocab to explain the flavors and the things that go on to it but it's it's amazing like i said i was making those open bread pizzas at home and this thing came in really handy i did not have to make a separate chutney also i made like a chicken momo thingy majingi at home i tried it it was amazing and again i was exhausted to do the whole chutney part and how can you have momos without chutney like chutney is the highlight it's like the underrated highlight and literally all i did was take equal proportions of this and the mayonnaise and just mixed it and served it to everybody and we all enjoyed it because the mayonnaise had its own flavor and this thing had its own and oh my god that pink sauce I live for it. But yeah, we're going to now move on to a healthier option just to save my ass cuz literally I feel guilty for telling you all of these unhealthy options, but this one right here is such a discovery and like if you have Nutella cravings which I did and I just didn't know what to do. Hmm, girl, and I'm talking to you about Tara. Oh my god, so this is the Alpino peanut butter in chocolate variant and this is the 1 kg bottle gluten free it's gmo free it's 100% amazingness and goodness and health in it and this comes in the variant of chocolate i mean it's very thick it's oh my god it smells amazing and this is extremely rich in protein and the diet that i'm doing right now is mostly like high in protein so this thing comes in really handy for me and it's really great for like a quick energy boost so i just have this for breakfast and i feel instantly amazing and okay so if you are someone who hates peanut butter you're going to love this cuz i hate peanut butter i have had it once and i was just like mm, no no i'm not doing this to myself but this does not taste like anything like peanut butter it's pure chocolate it pure chocolate taste and flavor and and i guess you get it in a crunchy variant as well i'm not sure uh, personally i like the smooth variant and this is amazing you have to get your hands on this okay next up on the list i have something very casual but i felt the need to express it to you that i do consume it and i really have fun with it and that is you guys a lot and lot a lot of makhanas i love having makhanas they're extremely healthy for now from what i know about them i believe they are lotus seeds and they're extremely amazing and for what i did in the past was i would get those ready made packets because i don't know how to flavor them at home but now i just get the plain ones because again you save a lot of money by getting the plain ones and then i bring it at home and i put a little bit of butter and then i just put in whatever flavor i'm feeling like and it turns amazing you should definitely try it again something really great to munch on to and extremely healthy and at the same time it's very stomach filling as well so it's like a win 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 situation now you guys talking about green teas i have tried a lot of them and i've hated almost all of them except this one this is tara this is the lemon and honey variant and the stuff is really great it's not very bitter it's not very sweet it's like a in between melange of flavors if i may and yeah this is like the green tea i use this is the green tea flavor i like the one that i hate the most like mm -mm, don't give it to me this green tea right here i mean sorry for the box condition is the lipton green tea in lemon zest isse acha tum zehar de do ni matlab i'm not even kidding de do zehar kisi ko bhi like why why would you make a green tea flavor in lemon zest like lemon to me is like very citrusy and like yummy and then you give me this okay with that being said let's talk something fun let's talk something cheesy if i may now i know a lot of people are obsessed with cheese and they like can go and munch on to cheese like that's not who i am that's not me however there's this um cheddar cheese that i got my hands from big basket and can i just tell you first of all it's healthy second of all it's quite affordable for a cheddar cheese to be honest at the same time it is absolutely amazing it's rich in protein also you can try feta cheese it is made up out of goat milk so that's something you are okay with i am not if you are you can try feta cheese for sure again it's super healthy but with that being said there is something which is not healthy but i found it and i can't give up on it and that is tada i 
actually got it from a local supermarket and this is the Delecta, Delecta, I don't know how to say this, but this is like a cheese spread. Uh, I know this looks very small, but you get a lot, a lot of creamy, cheesy goodness in here. And this stuff comes in really handy. Like I've used quite a bit of it. And with that, guys, we are reaching to the last bit of this video. And I'm talking to you about Tara. Now, these are something that I found on, again, Amazon. Amazon is like my best friend right now. And these are from the house of Indian Kitchen Herbs. And this is their oregano and their chili flakes set, which I got for 200 rupees. And, and for what I can tell you, the chili flakes is bomb diggity 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 dot com. <laughs> because this stuff is amazing. I love, I love the spiciness in here. I mean, these are so far my favorite chili flakes. And I've tried a couple, not a lot, a few. And from those lot, I love this one the most. With that being said, in terms of this oregano, now, okay, I know we all struggle with, or what I've heard a lot of people say is they can never find the Domino's Vala uh, oregano. It's very different for me. Like I said, I'm pretty amateur when it comes to food and flavor. So I really <laughs> never tried finding oregano outside. Uh, but from what I remember having Domino's long, long, long time ago, I feel this is quite close of an oregano like the Domino's one. If it is not, don't come at me. Either way, this is a really good oregano and something you can get off of Amazon, literally. And by the way, guys, when was the last time you had Domino's? For what I remember, it's been a solid year for sure since I had Domino's. So that's that. I don't remember Domino's oregano taste and smells like anymore, but... Uh, this is your best shot from what I can remember. And with that, you guys, you've come to the end of today's video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, you know what to do. Give this video a big, 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 big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I upload videos twice a week. So don't forget to hit on the bell notification so that you get updated every time I'm online. You can also follow me on my social media, the links to which will be in the description and up on my screen. And guys, I'm making a lot of reels. I'm making a lot of creative content. <laughs> if I may, I don't know what that was but like we're just gonna roll past that but yeah making a lot of fun content with fashion makeup and everything i love which is me so you get to see a lot of me on my social media i'm pretty active there as well so definitely follow me and with that being said i will see you super soon till then xoxo love y'all